announcement before we get going the current theatrical production at PACA is every brilliant thing only one more weekend Friday and Saturday that's February 18th and 19th get your tickets PACA1505.org but without further ado I would like to welcome to the PACA live stage West Indian Revelation featuring Andrani and Fuzz Samuel I 
I ask for the recipe. Bless me, done right. Tastes so nice. Eat it once, and you won't get dry. Bless me, done right. Tastes so nice. Eat it once, and you won't get dry. Black beans and rice, 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 black beans and rice. It's what you have for dinner. Bite after bite. I say again, it makes you wanna lick your fingers. Black beans and rice taste so nice. Eat it once and you won't want it twice. Thank you. You know, in this world, there's always hungry people. Here's my other song about food. But... People get hungry in Mississippi too. Wooden spoon, wooden spoon, wooden spoon. Wooden spoon, wooden spoon. Ah, 
Respect to Johnny Hooker. He knows how to cook music. Wooden spoon, wooden spoon. Wooden spoon, wooden spoon. Wooden spoon, wooden spoon. Wooden spoon, wooden spoon, wooden spoon, wooden spoon, wooden spoon. She don't know, don't know how to cook. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Thank you, thank you so much for coming tonight. I hope you all enjoy the show. We are going to start off with um, a song that's very special to me. Um, it was inspired by my brother who passed away uh, about two years ago. I can't remember exactly, but it's a beautiful song. I hope you guys enjoy it. Um, it's about keeping one another close and just making the most of every moment and not taking each other for, for granted. So it's also a very good message for Valentine's Day and hope you guys enjoy it. Thank you. Cherish the one you love Cherish the one you love Give thanks to 
Thank you. All right, and in that vein, we're going to do another song that also has to do with loving one another and sticking by one another through thick and thin. I hope you like it. It's called Stand By Me. Stand by. 
Dreadlock. Dreadlock Warrior. This is a really fun song. It's about when a bunch of people in England got very angry about the situation of poverty. And they went on a rampage, attacking all the stores and grabbing everything that they could. And uh, they all ended up uh, in the hands of Scotland Yard.
All right, the next song we're going to do is another song about cherishing the people that are around us and just realizing that it's not about where you are in this world, but the people that you're with. And anywhere can be paradise, and it all really depends on the people that you're surrounded by. Hope you guys are enjoying the show so far. You found 
direction, a more a serious, somber kind of direction, and we're going to sing, a, we're going to do a song about a historical event, an actual historical event that happened in the 1800s, and it's part of our, our history, our, our black history, and the song tells a story about an event that happened in the 1800s on the island of Barbados. It's called Hanging Tree. Tree. 
the hanging tree. The hanging tree. The hanging tree. They hang them down, yes, they hang them down. Put them on the gallows in the name of the crown. They hang them down. They hang them down, they hang them down. Put them in the gallows in the name of the crown. They hang them down. It was a tragedy. Hanging tree is in a place called St. Philip's Barbados. It's a 
500-year-old FICO Street. We're gonna take you to different places. The music, because Revelation is about change. And sometimes in music, if you don't be spontaneous, you're gonna end up like everybody else. Stale music and stale music don't taste good. Yeah. But, so we're gonna do a very classic song that came out of the same plantation of Bailey's. But it's not about a tree. It's just about a light. So we're going to take it back down to the, well, we already were in the island. So we're going to sing a song about carnival. And carnival is, I'm sure you guys know what carnival is, but in the Caribbean on the islands, it's a big deal. Beautiful costumes, 
delicious food every summer. It's a really big event. And all the islands have their own version of carnival, but they're all pretty much the same. So we're going to take you down to the carnival. I hope you guys enjoy it.
Rosie Samuel. Six. 
Thank you everybody, we love you.